Let's get right to it. Technical interviews are hard. The easiest way to prepare for them is to know the foundation questions like you know your phone number. I've scoured the internet to help you find resources that are going to help you on your path towards a data analyst. SQL questions are going to be part of every data interview you ever have. Start your data career off right by memorizing the most common questions. You're going to see them all the time. For example, if I ask you right now, what's a primary key? You shouldn't have to pause or think about the answer. You should immediately respond with, a primary key uniquely identifies each row in a table. Each table can only have one primary key. Knowing the most common SQL questions for interviews is going to make your life a lot easier and a lot less stressful and make interview preparation much easier. The resource on screen is fantastic. It's free and all you need to do is navigate to it and learn the most common questions. I'll put a link to all these resources below this video. Here's a tip. I like to use note cards. I put one question on each card. I flip through the cards and put the ones I know aside. I keep doing this until I know all the questions. This approach does a few things for you. Firstly, you've written down the questions and answers in your own words. Studies have shown you retain more when you put the concept in your own words. Next, you're using a technique called spaced repetition. Spaced repetition leverages a memory phenomenon called spacing effect, which describes how our brains learn more effectively when we space out our learning over time. When you use note cards, you're combining these several approaches to learning that are well known for long-term memory retention. If you're serious about becoming a data analyst and attaining your first real-world job, then you're using my platform LogicBot to learn SQL and Power BI for the skills you need. For those new to this path, you're going to need three things before you start sending out resumes for your career as a data analyst. You're going to need to know SQL. You're going to need to know Power BI. And most importantly, you need to prepare and pass exam PL300. Don't take this exam without using an exam simulator. You'll fail it. Before you attempt this exam, study the exam simulator on LogicBot. Okay, you've passed PL300 and you're ready to start preparing for interviews. This next resource is great. It's been updated this year and has all the interview questions you'll likely see for Power BI. This is a great resource for preparing for your Power BI interview questions. Alright, let's go over the steps again. Learn SQL. Study the SQL questions on this page until you know them and understand them. Learn Power BI. Study the exam simulator for PL300. Take and pass the exam. Study the questions on this page. Attending your first job is going to be difficult. The more prepared you are, the better chance you have at landing your first role. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And have a great day. We'll see you soon.